Um, the Center for the Arts uh, features artists and arts organizations that live in the Lake Sunapee region. And we have events every month on the first Friday of every month that are free events for the community and also special events throughout the year. So we do a performing arts series, a literary arts series. We have summer art shows, which is what we're here to talk about today. Um, and we also have gatherings of artists and um, members throughout the year, which are uh, gala events and fundraising. So we do quite a bit. Um, we're all volunteers, and we love community involvement. So what we're here to talk about today are summer art shows, and we have two great shows for you. One is an outdoor, under the tent, fresh air event that will be on July 18th. And there's another art show at the livery this summer, which will run the entire week, July 18th through the 26th. And Rick, do you want to talk about that? Sure. Um, the livery is a beautiful, old building, a great building to do an art show. I went there four years ago and had a tour and met Barbara Sullivan, who's one of the driving forces behind it and decided we have to do a show here. So uh, then I heard about a show in New York State that, that combined uh, in a big old beautiful barn. They had over 100 artists and it was all for land conservation fundraisers. So we call it Naturally New England and it's New England landscapes and wildlife. And we have over 50 artists. This is the third year we've been doing it. And it's such a beautiful gallery space. Uh, this year, we're able to do uh, COVID cautions because it's such a big open space and people can um, social distance and we can let people in a few at a time. So we have artists from all over New Hampshire and Vermont, mostly landscapes and, and a fair amount of, of wildlife paintings, photography, uh, mixed media. So we're excited about being able to be one of the few art shows that will be available this summer in this Sunapee Harbor, which is becoming more and more of, a, of an arts destination. Uh, Prospect Hill Gallery, I think, is one of the best galleries in central New Hampshire. So we hope to attract a lot of people. We used to do it first two years in conjunction with the, the League of New Hampshire Craftsmen Craftsman's Fair, which is not happening this year, so uh, we're not coordinating with that. But it's going to be a great show, and there's all sorts of information on our website, Center for the Arts New Hampshire, about the show and other shows. We also have five micro galleries in New London, where we do um, every three months we do new shows in those five galleries. So uh, a lot of information on the website. Check it out. Thanks, Rick, for that information. And I want to mention that we are partnering this year with the LSVNA, Lake Sunapee Visiting Nurses Association. We try to partner with uh, an organization every year so that we uh, are uh, providing a venue for the artists to show their work and sell their work, but we're also giving back to the community in a significant way. So we hope you'll uh, join us at the livery and online because both venues will be available for, to see and to purchase artwork. Um, and also, I want to make a very important statement here. We have Arts on the Green happening on July 18th from 10 to 4, rain or shine. We are adjusting everything uh, due to the COVID restrictions, and we will have half as many artists this year as we usually have. We have a dozen excellent craftsmen and fine artists that have been juried in everything from oil paintings to jewelry, metal craft, pottery, oh, stained glass. I'm trying to remember all of the different uh, types of art, but it will be a beautiful show, and this is such a beautiful place to spend the afternoon. I hope you'll come down to the Sunapee Harbor on July 18th and spend some time with us looking at the fine crafts and arts that are here. We'll have masks, hand sanitizer, uh, there'll be everything will be at the information booth and also at each tent and uh, so hopefully the flow will go smoothly and people will keep their social distance but you'll still be able to have a great afternoon so for more information about the naturally New England show which is at the livery July 18th through 26 and arts on the green which is here in Sunaby Harbor on the green on July 18th 10 to 4 please go to our website there'll be information about all the artists all the artwork the hours to visit and all of our upcoming events that will take place during the year.